Ooh. Oh. What? What? Oh. What? <laughs>
but the CC feels good. Hey, yo, shout out all my fans. So Stockton put a screw in there. We're trying to get that cap off because that cap is like sealed in there. <laughs> yeah. It's you like, know, it's like, like sealed and stuff. It's sealed and stuff. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Boing. Slap that thing into your radiator. Yeah. There we go, though. Oh. Oh, what? All right, so just updating the video because uh, the last clip was us getting the cap off and then finding the real problem. And we kind of cut it from there. Because so, we were so shocked. Yes, yeah, so this is like extreme rare case, N52, N51, whatever. Anyway. We, so, don't, we don't know why it happened. Yeah, I need to get this cap back off. Yep. So, um, when we got the cap off, we noticed over on the left side, this um, chain guide, this, and on this specific chain circuit, this chain guide also has these uh, spring steel um, liners on the back of it. So this is also the tensioner. Um, and as you can see, it's like offset and pinching the chain. And if you can see, I can, I can move it really, really easily. Um, that, guide is snapped in half and this is the true problem the whole time so um the symptom was that the vacuum pump was not operating right which made it look like the vacuum pump was faulty when in reality it's actually the chain setup that is messed up due to the guide and tensioner being broken this is an extreme rare case i've talked to several people cc's talked to several people that have been work on bmw's for you know, 10, 15, 20 years, and no one's ever seen this before on an N51. I mean, it's like typical N20 timing chain guides. Um, you know, that's typical to see. I've seen several, but I've never seen the oil pump and vacuum pump chain guides break. Yeah, um, but this chain down here, um, this isn't like my timing chain. So this doesn't affect like the timing of the engine. Yeah, they're two things completely like that. different. Uh, we also aren't a hundred percent sure if if this were to fail completely, if my oil pump would have not been um, getting any pressure. We still don't know if that would have been the case yeah. or not. But either um, way, either a chain way, down in the engine. Yeah, is not you don't ideal. want that. Um, obviously, uh, this could have been disastrous if the vacuum pump wasn't driven by this. Because uh, the only reason we knew is because. The brakes. Yeah, because the brakes had uh, low assist. So um, if we didn't go to replace this, we would have never seen this until one day that guide completely fell down and then there'd be so much tension for so much slack in the chain, it could have popped out. So super, super, super unlucky, but we're all- Exactly. So um, the plan is obviously don't want to drive the car because not only do I not have brakes, but we don't want to make the problem any worse. Um, so. Obviously, I'm in Wilmington. Stockton's shop is in Durham. We need to get the car up there. So first and foremost, we need to, we have a parts list on what we need to order for the car. Um, and once we get those parts ordered and we know when they're gonna arrive, we can kind of plan around when we're going to do the work on the car. The issue is you need to be down here so that we can tow it up yeah. um, because Stockton has AAA and I don't. Um, so he's probably gonna have to drive down here literally just to drive back with me while we basically see the car towed, which would make sense because then I don't have to take two cars up there. You can just drive me up and then I'll drive this car back. So we're gonna figure that out in the next coming weeks. Um, but in some good news is that Stockton's M3 has some goodies coming up yes. so um i'll be making a video on his car which is nice his car is running great and he's doing some stuff so 
yeah, finally. So that'll be the content while this car is down. I don't know, I might still come up if the weather is not bad. We'll see. Um, we'll see. I really wanna be there. So yeah, that's the update. Um, needed to process this, take a couple days. Um, I was upset. I was depressed. I still kinda am, because I really wanna drive my car. But um, yeah, so as you guys know, we also still need to put my front control arms on. Um, so that needs to happen also, and you figure out when. Um, but yeah, so, meh, sad. Um, we'll see you guys soon. Bye.